Aluminium pens, old school, fat ones. Another day, another egg. Using only the items currently on this table, get this egg as high as possible. Highest wins. The egg must not break. You have 20 minutes. Your time starts now. Get it as high as possible using these items. So I've got colouring pens. Well, why would I use pens? A measuring tape, a scissors. OK. I've just got paper and that's it. Show you got everything. <laughs> Could have done with a box, really. <laughs> <laughs> So, just to make it clear, they can't break the egg. If they break the egg, they're disqualified, right? That's right, that's very okay. clear. One egg and get it as high as possible. Oh, God, I'm just... That sort of thing. Is that? <laughs> Goose. I'm gonna boil it. <laughs> Major salad <laughs> Crafts. Gonna have to go outside. That's promising. Two minutes. Egg. Ah! One minute thirty. Shh. Bollocks. Crap. Fuck off. One minute ten. Okay. How long? Forty-one seconds. How long? Twenty-six seconds. turning into who cannot break an egg in 20 minutes. One of my problems was I didn't notice the saucepan and the electric cooker on the table. <laughs> I'm really sorry you didn't see them. Maybe I'll give you an extra point. If you... Uh, I swear to God, man. <laughs> I, I, I'm just saying they, they clearly weren't on display, and that's not fair, is it? Look, you're really pissing me off tonight, man. <laughs> Hi, James. Bunch of eggs. Oh. Hi, James. <laughs> hungry? Not for an egg. Find the boiled egg. You may touch two eggs. You may damage two eggs. You may not damage the boiled egg. You may touch two eggs. You may damage two eggs. So I can damage two and touch two. But you can only touch two. Fastest wins, your time starts now. Find the boiled egg. <laughs> Wait. Oh. <laughs> it's quite hard. <laughs> Pretty easy to find the boiled egg, isn't it? Yeah, obviously you can spin it, couldn't you? Spin it. Spin the boiled egg, stop it, and what will it do? It'll stop. Stop immediately, whereas an unboiled egg will... Spin it. ...carry on spinning because yeah. of the stuff inside the egg keeps it spinning. We all know that. Yeah, yeah. Or you could put it in... Uh, salt water. Salt water. It'll float, won't it? Yeah. Everyone knows that. What? <laughs> Do you want to see which method they used? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that could still be a boiled egg that's been painted red. Boiled egg in cling film. I guess you could boil that. That is not an egg. It's made of rubber or some shit. Take that out of the equation. That's not touching the egg, I'm touching the egg cup. Suck it. <laughs> touching the cling film, not the egg. I hear it gooping. Gooping? Yeah. <laughs> that egg's hollow. That's a shell. Didn't touch it. You can damage one more egg. That's an egg shell, not an egg. Damaged no eggs yet. <laughs> Ooh. It's feeling solid. Is that a real egg? Okay, that's not an egg. That's not a hard-boiled egg. Have you damaged it? Yes. In that case, it's between this one and that one. It's this one. That's the hard-boiled egg. According to my records, that is your fifth use of your catchphrase, suck it, the yes. service. <laughs> and a new catchphrase was born during that. I could hear it gooping. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 
Eat me fastest wins. Sheesh. Hey! Ah! Oh, man. I hate eggs. <laughs> Eat me fastest wins. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm not eating a raw egg. Eat me. Well, that's not going to work, is it? Am I going to eat it raw? Mm, I, I do need to warn the people at home that you shouldn't eat raw eggs. <laughs> a pretty straightforward task. <laughs> and it would genuinely disgust me. Would it disgust you? Eating an egg? A raw egg? Well, no, I mean, you've got options. You can scotch it, you can do whatever you want. You know, you can... <laughs> <laughs> so I, I would scotch the egg. If any of you guys have scotched this egg, I think we should get the point. <laughs> There's a man called Joey Chestnut who ate 141 what? eggs in eight minutes. That's Good old Joey Chestnut. <laughs> <laughs> he did one egg every three and a half seconds for eight minutes. Okay. Uh, do you want to see Joe next? Yes, I do. Okay, here is Joe Wilkinson. I, um, I knew I wasn't going to win this one, so I thought I'd actually enjoy it. <laughs> Ten minutes, 46, to eat an egg. Took a hit on that one, mate. <laughs> Took a hit on it. Lovely. Um, I wish there were points for style. Cause it's <laughs> really lovely meat display, particularly. Yeah, I did a, a crescent of salami. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And, and a crescent Opposite of sausage a rolls. Crescent of, uh, yeah. sausage rolls. You know, standard stuff. <laughs> <laughs> really well done. Last place so far. <laughs> <laughs> Hello there. I like it when there's a, when there's um, a variety. An egg, a balloon, some bread, some rice. It could. It's almost um, a meal, isn't it? But possibly one in North Korea. A bit of horse, <laughs> a bit of rice, a bit of egg, and a balloon. <laughs> <laughs> something I'd make at art college. <laughs> yes. 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 Where's the task? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Without touching the egg or the egg cup. Get the egg into the egg cup. You may only use the equipment currently on the table. If you touch a piece of equipment that another contestant touches... Ah! You'll both receive a one-minute time penalty. Per piece of equipment touched. Fastest wins. Your time starts now. So I can touch anything, but if anybody else touches it... But I'm not allowed to touch that or that. Wow, OK. Fastest wins. OK. Your time. Time starts now. Absolutely famous. Time starts well. now. OK. Right. Um... Oh, so, oh uh, yeah. Somebody might... I, yeah, somebody might have touched those already. Oh, man. Why is, th why is that there? I just touched it again. I just, look, I mean, I've touched them all now. That's just, I'm sorry. Why is, why, is there, why is there a horse there? They're going to canter over. <laughs> oh, you see, that's good. That acts as a sort of bread glove. Exactly 57 seconds now. But then I've got a one, two, three, four, five, six-minute penalty, haven't I? Only if everyone else has touched. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> that I really enjoyed that though. <laughs> <laughs> which uh, which bit of it did you enjoy, Mel? <laughs> I like touching all the items. <laughs> 
<laughs> Did you hear Hugh audibly sigh, knowing he was off the hook during that? <laughs> Hello, Lisa. Hey, girl. Hello. Hello, Russell. How's it going? I'm feeling very happy today. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that egg. <laughs> <laughs> I've just had a coffee. <laughs> Can I just uh, crack into this? Oh, it's so tiny. Put something genuinely surprising inside this chocolate egg. <laughs> you have one hour after which Alex will open your chocolate egg. Your time starts now. Now then, I, it's normally there's something to read. <laughs> so I said, I'm going to actually go away. OK. Because obviously I've got to be surprised by it. Yes, of course. See you in an hour, mate. I thought I could put a spider in it. I really hate spiders, so I'm like, how am I going to catch a spider and then put a spider in it without touching a spider or looking at a spider? So I'm just going to go in the garden and see whether or not I can, using this system, um, catch a bee. Taskmaster. If I do this, it'd be television history. <laughs> please, God, please, please, please. When you want to try and find a bee, what's the first thing you do? Climb a tree. Climb a tree. <laughs> <laughs> okay, should we start with Alice Levine's attempt? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. This egg contains the key to your fortune. Wasn't expecting that. Mm, there he is. I wasn't expecting this to be in it. So, so far, so surprised. Oh. It says my personal identification number. Is which is correct. <laughs> it's also the code for my phone. And when you um, go into my house, my burglar alarm. Are you surprised? I'm quite surprised. <laughs> it was unsettling, Alice. Well, I think that's a bonus emotion, but I think surprise was the premier one. I was quite surprised I said it out loud as well. After. <laughs> I was really surprised you said it out loud. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Two things for those of you who are confused by the beeps. Alex's personal identification number is 3047. Beep. Beep. <laughs> um, There's very little left now. Well, how surprised were you? Well, I was surprised that you'd found out the number. I was surprised that my wife apparently had given her the number. <laughs> I was surprised by the amount of money that's come out of my account since then. <laughs> so, yeah, I was overall surprised. For more Taskmaster, subscribe now. <laughs> <laughs>